hey rosely farms good afternoon welcome back to my channel if you are new here my name is roslyn and this youtube channel name is roslyn inyagbo for my old subscribers you are always welcome for tuning in thank you and god bless you guys today i made a fried fish and baked orange potato with some sauce yeah guys if you want to know how I make this beautiful yummy dish, please subscribe to my YouTube channel, like and share, and also don't forget to sit down, relax, and watch. Guys, guys, here are my ingredients. I have my washed and peeled potato, Irish potato. Here is the unpeeled one. And then uh, I have my fish, it is washed, nicely cleaned. Then I have my lemon, I have my chopped parsley, fresh chopped parsley. I have my breadcrumbs, I have salt to taste, I have melted butter, and I have my mixed seasoning here. In here I have paprika powder, onion powder, ginger powder, garlic powder, wh uh, white pepper, yeah then salt i'll be using it to season my fish so and then i also have fish powder here so let's get started guys so here i'm going to make a pour a cut on the fish for the seasoning to penetrate properly flip it over and do the same This will help the seasoning penetrate into the fish properly. So, now that we are done, take out this and we start rubbing in the seasoning. Okay? Make sure you rub it well if you want your fish to have nice taste. So guys, here I'm done. I will be frying the fish. So I'm going ahead and put my, I'll go ahead and put my vegetable oil on the fire for it to be hot before frying. Okay. So guys, here I have the vegetable oil on the pan. We will allow it to get heated before frying. Meanwhile, let's go and cut our potato before baking it. Guys, here is my Irish potato. The reason I'm using my spatula to wedge it because I don't want to cut the whole of the potato. So watch, guys. Let me change the camera position so you can see very well. Yeah. So now I will cut. Is what I want, like so. So I'll go ahead and put it in my baking pan. Continue with the rest. I'm using my other thumb to press down the the wooden stick or the spatula so it doesn't move, so that I don't cut myself.
guys the oil is hot so next we'll add our fish be careful So guys, I'm done cutting the potato. Next, I'm going to be cutting it with the melted butter. So, like so. Then next, I will sprinkle my breadcrumbs on it. So I will bake it for 10 minutes. After 10 minutes, I will bring it out from the oven. Then we'll probably it with the butter, then bake for another 15 minutes. Okay, guys, let's bake. So guys, the fish, the other part of fish has been frying. Now I'm going to be flipping it over. Can see. Oh, we let the other side cook. Oh, well, guys, it's ten minutes already. So let's add more butter. Oh well, guys, we bake more, another 10 to 15 minutes. Guys, our fish is ready. I'll go ahead and take it out from the oil. It is ready, fully fried. Where is it? Place in a paper towel to absorb the excess oil. Here is the fish, guys. So beautiful. So why the fish is ready? Let me squeeze in some lemon on it. Lemon is very good. So I'll serve it. Guys, the potato is ready. Yeah. It's soft. So let's save. Guys, we are done. Look at.
try this at home guys and you come back and thank me especially those who don't like eating beef all the time fish is good for the body try it guys here is my delicacy Irish potato fish and sauce then lemon thank you guys for always watching please like my video share and subscribe guys i love you all bye